us about your music lesson. So, my instrument named Lyra is a Greek traditional instrument and the roots is from ancient Greece, over 2,000 years history. Yeah, for sure. Uh, this is my life. This is my life and this is the reason that changed my life. I, I play, I am composer, I play traditional songs, but uh, at the same time, I would like to show to the people that this instrument can play very, with very unique version, famous songs, modern songs, modern compositions. When you say traditional songs, you mean Hasapiko and Samiko and the dances? Yeah, this is, this is Greek rhythms, uh, famous Greek rhythms. But my, my cultural root is Pondos. Pondos is a big part of Greek uh, traditional music. Right. Except that they are very, very good musicians. They are my friends. Oh, that's great. And you know, when an artist has with him good team, good, good friends, good musicians, uh, I think is the best. Is the best. Is the best. So I, I would like to say the reason that uh, I moved from Greece to Toronto is one of my best friends, Pavlo. Oh. Pavlo Simtikidis, you know Pavlo. Of course. Uh, this guy changed my life. Really? This, this guy is the reason that I moved, because after, uh, after the DVD of Pavlos, yeah. from Castoria, uh, Castoria from, for the PBS special, yeah. uh, I gave him uh, a CD with my demos, with my new compositions, from uh, uh, mix from music from my cultural roots and uh, modern music. And after a few months, Pablo called me and uh, awesome. told me, Lazo, this is not a gift for me. Okay, Pablo, why? This is your new career here in Canada and the US. And after, after a few things, I moved. Uh, I, oh, am here, I am here, I am here eight years. So you played on the Castoria DVD? Yeah, and uh, the new one, Santorini. That's amazing. And so tell us more about that. You were in Greece at the time when he yeah, in you? Greece. And I'm very happy because many people that I don't know them, ah, you're Lazo. Uh, we saw you, we saw you on the PBS, on yeah, TV. Yeah. And this is, uh, made me very happy. Together. That's great. So, okay, so your, your influences are traditional. Was there anybody in particular that you uh, wanted to copy or, or sound like? Sound is sometimes with rock background, sometimes ethnic, yeah. Balkan. I love Balkan music, I love Balkan music. Uh, sometimes 100% traditional, but the surprise is something rock, something reggae. Right. I, I, I play world music. I play world music. Cool. And so that goes very well with Pablo's. Yeah, Pablo is Mediterranean. He's a Greek style. Yeah. But I, I, we have similar, similar things. We have similar things. You know, because we are Greeks. We are Greeks. <laughs> I know. <laughs> this year is my second time in this big festival. Jazz Fest? Yeah. yeah. For me, for me, as I know, this is the biggest music festival. Music. I say music festival because the audience, the bands, all is quality. All is quality for this festival. I'm very happy. I'm very happy. How do we find you on the internet? Lazo I. Uh, my website is lazo minor i.com. I have Instagram, Facebook, everywhere who can uh, find me. That's great. So I just have one more question, uh, maybe two, if you have time. One is, I found from Woodstock movie, the 60s, this yeah. British guy with a, a tie and the shoes, he comes in and he's talking to some kid, and the kid was in mud, you know? And he says, why is music the great communicator? For me, for me, the music is world language. 
It doesn't matter if you are Chinese, if you are Greek, if you are uh, Canadian. The music connects the people. And this is one of the reasons that my, my project named an ancient sound for a new world. Because many times my audience is not only Greeks. Many times uh, like my music Chinese people, sure. Persian people, Irish people. Uh, the music is the only minor. good thing. Yeah. Only good thing. Yeah. Awesome. Now one last question then. Yeah. Anything funny from the road, from all your travels, any funny stories? I have, I have, <laughs> I have one story very funny. I went, I went from here to LA, to Los Angeles for a show, and I forgot my instrument here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I have one, one, my one friend that he plays a little bit, lira there, not professional, yeah. but, and I called him and I say, I hope you are here. Oh, yes, Lazo, I am here and I, I will come to, to see you. <laughs> oh, okay, bring with you your instrument. <laughs> so, you, so you played somebody else's lira in LA. Yeah, yeah. Greek people play for Greek tell, community. Tell his name, say thank you. Uh, oh, okay. Co uh, <laughs> okay. Gas, Costas, Costas. Costa. I don't know. Uh, yeah. That's good, Costa. Thank you, Costa. Thank <laughs> you, Costa. Story. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> this was very, very very bad position, <laughs> yeah. you know, and I remember it for the play. I didn't... They were already off the ground. Well, it's great that your fans can come through like that. Listen, thank you for being on Musicians in Bars Getting Beer, but we're not in a bar getting beer. Someday we'll get a Uzo yeah. together, yeah. I hope. And I hope, I hope to see you one of my shows here. Not only the festival, one of my shows a real next show. season. Yeah. I, I am very happy because many times uh, they come to see and listen my music musicians. And when I, when I listen from someone musician that my music is very good, it's like I'm, I'm double happy. I'm oh, double yeah. happy. I appreciate it. Thanks for being on the show. Thank you. Harry Stone. Harry Stone.